Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to the channel. We're gonna do another giveaway. If you happen to see my last video, we released the winner of the giveaway from a previous video. And hey, I'm feeling generous, let's do another giveaway. So this giveaway will be for either a $30 plant pack or a free piece of Christopher Scott merch from freshwaterscrub.com. And I will give you instructions how to enter this giveaway at some point throughout this video. So make sure you watch through and figure out how to enter. This will be a random winner and I will be utilizing a random comment picker in order to pick the winner so make sure you stay tuned and follow the instructions to enter this video's giveaway if you'd like to shop at freshwaterscrub.com make sure you use the code pond for 10 percent off your entire order through the 31st of may 2022 so with that let's get into this video today what is going on everybody well welcome to the channel if you happen to be new thanks for stopping by and for anybody else welcome back listen today we're going to be focused on this backyard pond where we have all of our little baby bullfrogs they're doing so fantastic we have all of our shabunkins everything is doing well in there turtle stew turtle soup looking at this backyard pond this thing looks amazing we got all of this frog bit back here. Our baby frogs are in here. In fact, take a look at this clip right here where we got to see them. Absolutely adorable, and I'm so glad that I got those things for this backyard pond. We have a bunch of Shabunkin goldfish in here, as always, and we have some rosy reds that were left from last year that have grown into, like, really big rosy reds, and they're fantastic. We're going to try to breed some rosy reds in here, and what we need to do is we need to go pick up some terracotta pots as well as some additional fish to go in here. So today, we are, in fact, going to be restocking this pond with thousands of fish so with that let's go ahead and jump in the jeep get out of here and go pick up thousands of fish for this backyard pond All right, guys, well, we're back with our supplies and we have some pots. And the reason for this is, is because after reading and researching, it appears that rosy reds actually will breed and lay eggs inside a pot. So we're gonna sink some of these pots down inside of this pond. Here's another one here, we'll put one in this corner. And uh, that one's down. Put that one over here. Got a couple small ones. Maybe put one right over there. We'll put one final one right over here. So with that guys, now let's go ahead and get some fish in here. All right guys, we're breaking from the video for just a second to give you instructions on how to enter this video's giveaway. To enter the video's giveaway, all you have to do is simply comment your favorite animal below. If you have multiple, comment them in individual comments because the more times you comment the better chances you have of being randomly selected to receive either a $30 plant pack or a piece of Christopher Scott merch from freshwaterscrub.com. So blow up the comments and good luck to everybody. I will randomly pick a winner from this video's comments while filming my next video. So you will see the winner in the next video. So make sure you stay tuned. But with that, let's get back into this video today. Well, real quick before we get out of here, I want to come up here and take a look at this front porch pond and look at how great this thing is doing. All of these mollies are doing great. This pothos is doing amazing. Look at this thing. Ah. 
obviously was in a hurry. This pothos is looking amazing. Look at the size of these leaves. I mean, doing so great out here in this pond. And all of the duckweed and frog bit. We have some hornwort in here, as well as some java ferns, but everything is doing fantastic out here and looking great. So if you haven't watched this video, make sure you go back and watch us put this thing together. So let's go back out and look at the backyard pond again, because it's actually been about a week since we filmed those last segments on this pond. Let's see how all those fish are doing. So as always, we're gonna try to sneak up and see our baby bullfrogs, which I don't know how well that's gonna work, but let's go see. Well, we don't see any today, but that's okay. Oh, there went one. We missed it. They are doing fantastic out here. I am sure of it. But looking at this thing, this thing is crystal freaking clear. Look at all of the fish. We got mollies in here that Brenton put in here. We have all of these rosy reds, these massive rosy reds. Everything is looking great. We got a bunch of goldfish and then of course our shabunkins are out here. But everything is looking fantastic out here. Everything is doing great. In fact, there's our shabunkins right there that you can see. This right here is our UV clarifier and this is what keeps this water so crystal clear. Look at that. Those right there are all feeder guppies. We have a multitude of fish in here. You can see one of these larger dark colored fish right here. That is actually called a gambusia, which is a live bearer. It's used as a feeder fish. You can see them over there on the surface of the water. We got all the mollies down here in the bottom. We have some feeder guppies. We have these large, extra, extra large rosy reds that are in here. Back over here, we have some regular just comet goldfish that are in here. Some more extra large rosy reds. And then plus a bunch of smaller rosy reds that are swimming around in here as well. We'll come over here and look underneath all of this frog bit and here are our shabunkins and they're all kind of underneath the cover and the shade because in case you didn't know this but fish can actually get sunburned and that's why we make sure that we have plenty of cover for these guys because we don't want them to get sunburned but all of it is looking great now in this bag right here i have a couple of things that we're gonna actually put in here. Number one is this beautiful red plant. I can't remember the name of this. It will be on the screen right here, but a wonderful, wonderful aquarium plant. We're actually gonna drop this in here because I'm testing something here and I wanna see what happens with these plants in the pond. I wanna see how well they actually grow in the pond. And we have a couple of different things. We also have some Creeping Charlie, which is a great aquatic, well it's actually, it'll grow on land as well as in the water. We got some duckweed in here. I wanna get that out because that stuff will overrun this pond quickly. Don't want any part of that. Maybe too late, I've already contaminated it with duckweed, which whatevs. We also have, let's see, we have another set of this really red, pink colored plant. We're gonna put this all down here and just try to get it to stay down towards the bottom. We wanna see what this stuff will do in the pond. And we also have some of these really cool swords. These are called Reuben swords and they will turn a really deep red color as well. So we're gonna put some of these in here just to see what happens with those guys. Then we have some of this Hydrophilia aragula, I believe is how you say it. Uh, but we're gonna try that out there too. We wanna see how that does. Some Anubius Frazeri. We got some new potted Anubius Frazeri in as well. See how all those do. Another Anubius Frazeri. Another one of those Reuben swords. And one final Reuben sword. So like I said, I just want to see how these plants do out here in an actual natural environment with a nice bio load in the pond, some natural food for these plants, as well as natural sunlight. I really want to see how these things do. All of this frog bit that's out here is recovered from over the winter, so it's doing fantastic. But I just want to kind of test this and see what happens. If you do need any aquatic plants, make sure you go find those at freshwaterscrub.com and use the code POND for 10 percent off all of your orders throughout the end of May 2022. Now with our new plant packs, if you were to purchase a plant pack that comes with random selected plants, some of these plants right here may be a part of your random selection. So make sure you go check out freshwaterscrub.com. But with that guys, this pond is really, really looking good. Coming over into this terrestrial area, I want to see if we can find old turtle stew. I'm sure she is in here somewhere. 
and there she is right there do you see her right in there look at that and she is backing up trying to get away from us but she is doing well and she loves her new home i am sure of it she's got access into the aquatic area there access back out she spends a lot of her time over here in the bushes up underneath the ferns and such just in the shade but she really really seems to like her new enclosure everything back here is looking great so with that hopefully you went on to enjoy this video and make sure that you enter the giveaway by just simply commenting below your favorite animal and if you have multiple comment them all in separate comments because the more times you comment the higher the probability you have of the random comment picker picking your comment to win this giveaway which will include either a 30 dollar plant pack or a piece of christopher scott merch from freshwaterscrub.com so make sure you enter but i wanted to just say thank you very much from the bottom of my heart i am greatly appreciative of each and every one of you for your support here on the channel as well as at freshwaterscrub.com for coming back and spending your time with us here on our youtube channel and hopefully you are enjoying the content so with that guys thank you from the bottom of my heart and hey we will see you next time